Hi everyone and welcome to my channel. I want to show you how to create shiny multicolored background using new mousses. I'm starting with tapping a card panel with a masking tape because I want to keep the bottom of my card white. Using blending sponge I'm applying first red color on the top of the card panel. This sponge is a great tool, it's washable and you will have 4 sponges in one set. I'm using new sponge for each color of new mousses to avoid messing my yours. Next I'm applying gold color, I'm lightly dabbing it over red mousse. My red color is still wet so I can easily blend both colors to create nice gradient. I go back and forth from red color to gold until I get nice result without any harsh lines. You can add a thicker layer of mousse and add a texture on the card panel. But I decided to have a smooth background and I'm planning to use my new stencil with snowflakes, so I will have a bit of texture. And I want to make a focal point in the center, where I will build my winter scene, that's why I'm using light color of Nuvo Mousse. I found in my stash this light mint color and I'm trying to blend it with gold one really well. I'm applying a nice thick layer of it and adding a gold mousse from time to time. You can use Nuvo Mousses in multiply different ways, that's why I love this medium. You can find all products I use in the description below the video or on the my blog. I've dried my card panel a little bit uh, and now I want to add snowflakes over it. The snowflakes are quite big, so you can use this stencil even on your layouts or any other project bigger than a card. I'm taping this beautiful stencil to my card panel and I'm going to cover it with thick layer of mousse. I choose pure platinum color of Nuvo Mousse for snowflakes, but I think Moonstone Glimmer Paste will look wonderful too. I carefully removed stencil and all masking tapes and here is my finished card background. Love this shiny look. While the panel dries, I will stamp a couple of the images from the Snow Globe stamp set. I'm stamping them using Nuvo Hybrid ink, this ink can be used with alcohol markers as well as with watercolor paints, because it's waterproof but it will not react with regular markers. Uh, to color my images I'm using Nuvo alcohol markers, they are vibrant and I can make really fast coloring with them. For Santa and Snowman I'm using only two shades of each color. I'm starting with light blue color and I'm applying it where I think shadow should be. I'm blending it with a transparent blender marker to create light spots. Next I'm coloring all red parts with a bright red marker and I will add a bit of shade with a darker marker. To color a beard I use light gray colors, all marker numbers you will see on the screen.
In same way, I colored a Christmas tree using two green shades, but I wasn't happy with the result. I got a harsh line over it. It happens when you used light and too dark color without any medium shade. So I covered wall image with another green color, and now I love how it looks. After my coloring is done, I cut out all images with scissors and I'm going to place them on the card. But first I'm attaching the card panel to the card base with liquid Nuvo glue. I want to decorate my card with glitter paper and here I have small leftover from the gold glitter paper and I'm adhering it right on the card. Using dimensional foam pads I'm attaching my images to the card. For my scene I decided to use only Santa with a Christmas tree and presents. I always prepare more images than I need uh, to have a choices of what to make scene from. The remaining images I use to decorate the inner space of the card. Now it's time to add a sentiment. I'm using a big stamp from Snow Globe stamp set and I'm stamping it using acrylic block and black Nuvo ink. So here you have a quick tip how to create Christmas card using Nuvo mousses. Thanks for joining me today. I hope you enjoyed this video. Be sure to subscribe to my channel. If you are a subscriber but aren't receiving new video notifications, check the bell icon on the home page of the channel to get notified every time there is a new video. Thanks for watching. See ya!